SDS2 Connect can design base or cap plate connections for vertical or sloping columns framing to flat or sloping beams. If loads require, transverse beam stiffeners will be designed as well. In setup, under design criteria, the option to always provide transverse beam stiffeners will force SDS2 Connect to always design a connection with stiffeners in the beam even if they are not required. Plate design criteria contains options to set the minimum beam stiffener plate thickness and the total stiffener clearance. The total stiffener clearance will be split half on top and half on bottom. As an example, with 1 8 set as shown, 1 16th inch clearance will be between the stiffener and the beam top flange as well as the bottom flange. Under standard fabricator connections, cap plate, a minimum cap plate thickness option is available. Align transverse stiffeners with determines if stiffeners are to be parallel with the column or perpendicular to the beam flanges. Currently, vertical columns do not get the correct setback information applied to them in Revit structure. However, slanted columns can be used and do get the correct setbacks. Since the option always provide transverse beam stiffeners mentioned earlier was turned off, SDS2 Connect will only generate those as the loads require. If a connection is edited and the load increased, SDS2 Connect will redesign the connection and provide either one or two pairs of stiffeners as required. Users can force stiffeners to be created or not by setting the option Use Transverse Beam Stiffener in connection specifications. Weld all around plate when set to yes provides a shop weld all around the base cap plate. And although this is not seen in the Revit model, if it were transferred to SDS2, this would be visible in that model. A setting of no will provide a shop weld to the column flanges only. Align stiffeners with allows users to override this option that was mentioned earlier in setup. When beam stiffeners are provided, users can specify one or two pairs through the design details. Keep in mind that beam stiffeners may clash with other elements or connections as SDS2 Connect does not check for clashes when creating these. We can see in this example that the stiffeners interfere with the bolts in the cap plate. Another example can be seen with a beam framing into the supporting beam above the column. And keep in mind the design details can be adjusted to adjust the position of the stiffeners so they do not interfere with other connections. Thank you for watching the SDS2 Connect Base Cap Plate Tutorial.